<laughs> Parents of fur babies, I'm one, you're mm, one. Yeah. Apparently they're finding ways to punish their pups online. Yeah, our Nikki Bussey has details on dog shaming. You know, if, if you've got a sense of humor, this is this is kind of funny. And if you have a dog, many of these are even funny. Oh gosh, it's just too cute and funny yeah. not to share. This Tumblr account is going viral. Now basically, if your dog does something <laughs> bad, Write it on a note like you see there, then take a pic of the dog beside the note. The signs are so funny. Everything from I ate my dad's paycheck to I pee on other dogs' heads. My dogs would probably say I pull garbage from the bathroom when I'm left alone. <laughs> that would tickle me. I eat the trash. <laughs> oh, I know. What about, what about your dogs? Oh, I'd have a book for Henry. I mean, between everything that he's eaten and what his... And his no, he didn't eat anything today, but I mean, in his first three and a half years <laughs> on Earth, he's eaten a lot of stuff. <laughs> They're really kind of funny. Oh, yeah. And if you've got, again, you, you, if you have a dog, it's really funny to see. <laughs> For sure. We'll talk about shaming. Oh. An elderly woman in Spain offered to renovate a one-of-a-kind 19th century fresco <laughs> painting by the Spanish painter Elias Garcia Martinez, but she basically ruined it. You can see it there, though. So here's the tough part. <laughs> her family had donated money to have it professionally fixed. The woman says her work kind of got out of hand. I would say so. <laughs> you think? <laughs> it looks nothing like the original. That's the understatement of and the decade And the fact, you know, so she's far. an older woman. You feel bad. Thing. <laughs> but she kind of messed it all up. <laughs> so they're trying to fix it. Who knows whether or not they're going to get that done. Oh. Keep you posted on that. Well, the famous <laughs> Jolie Pitt family could get even more famous. Angelina and Brad's daughter Vivienne is going to join Angie on the set of Maleficent. By the way, she's only four years old. This is, of course, is the movie about Sleeping Beauty and how the witch becomes evil. Vivienne is actually going to play a younger version of Aurora, also known as Sleeping Beauty. Maleficent is set to hit theaters on March of 2014. I still and love that. The pick. crowd goes wild. It will. They're going to be stars. They're beautiful, those kids. Like little cherubs. <laughs> They're cute. Well, President Barack Obama is already battling expected Republican President Romney. The new video game from the creators of the Infinity Blade series is making them physically fight. You can put the two in different costumes, different arenas, including the Oval Office, like you see there. Place your bets on. Uh, yeah, this is gonna who be you good. think's gonna win? <laughs> I mean, you can put them in all kinds of different things. I just had a hoot listening to the sound effects on it because it's just like political trash talking. Right, now let's look at the key so it's really issues funny. for this next debate. It's like mm. jib jab, yeah, stuff like that. You know? Yeah, you gotta have a sense of humor. They're pretty, to that. pretty close, <laughs> like on ha like the resemblance, I think. Yeah, not bad. Who knows if the president can move that fast or if Mitt Romney's able to take him out with a microphone. Hey, they're both in pretty good shape, though. They, they look are. good. Yeah, well, that's true. <laughs> they look really good in that video game, too. That's fine. Thanks, Nikki. Yeah. Thank you, Nick. Moving west, it looks like uh, Isaac, at least the path for Isaac, seems to be kind of shifting. Uh, good news for us as mm -hmm. far as um, you know, the potential for a landfall anywhere near the east coast. Yep, meteorologist Rob Ellis explains what it really means in just a few minutes.